Hello there, good chaps. Ryanikin here. Penny for your thoughts. To pay or not to pay, that is the question. The game at hand is Maze. An eloquent choice of... <coughs> that is one heck of an accent to hold. Welcome to Maze, a game where you play as something, never really did find out what. Surrounded by sentient corn, companions to a Russian bear. What? What are you looking at? Something on Vladis' face? This game is normally $21.99 Canadian, or $10.99 during this summer Steam sale, and thus my rush to put out this guide. I want you to be able to make your decision on this game before the Steam sale ends, and if you're watching this after... <laughs> I'm... I'm so sorry for your loss. So let's talk about game mechanics. You walk around with the classic WASD keys, pick up stuff with the left mouse button, use those items on other items, and you don't press the Q key. Going into this, I thought it was going to be a horror genre game, and I got ready to record a face cam and everything so as to catch my reactions. It is not. It is an eerie adventure game which follows Link. Yes, Link, he doesn't talk, so you play as Link. Why you no talk? Do you understand? Canon! It's canon! I can't make this stuff up! It's canon! And yes, I can do this! <coughs> now, is this game fun? Yes! I found the level of atmosphere, the quantity of dry humor, and the character development that I've seen thus far to be really unique, except for the corn people. They're all just absolute idiots. Hey! Hey! You must answer a riddle before you're allowed to enter. What animal walks on four legs in the morning? That one's boring! I'm riddle president today, I get to pick. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh, oh, yeah, 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 that's true. Was he oh, president right, every time? No, I've actually oh, always been a vote unclear on the election. Oh, we should well, yes, yes, that. <clears throat> Now I want to keep this video short as to not waste any more of your precious daytime, so would I buy this for its Steam sale price? Yes, 100% I would. Immediately, I got it during the, the monthly Humble Bundle, so I really didn't actually pay for the game, but I would totally buy it for $10.99. Would I buy this game at its full current retail price? No, probably not. According to HowLongToBeat.com, it takes three and a half hours to beat the game. And it's a great game to play through an afternoon, but not one I would go out of my way to play for. As you can see, there's a little bit of polish that needs to be done on the game before it gets to the great looking game status. I mean, the main game looks great, but to be honest, it's just cutscenes that seem to be somewhat lacking. But we would be remiss if we did not at least let you attempt to do something of value. And that's about it. I'd, I'd probably pay $15 for this. So during this summer Steam sale, this game is 100% worth picking up. And thanks for watching this quickie guide, and I will see you. And I will see you. And I will see you. It should be me. It should be me. Surrounded by idiots. Rattle. Underappreciated. Ridiculed. Scorned. Really, what is that? X is not a number. What? Why is that there? We should have kept one around to ask about that. Exit. Ugh. Ridiculous. Hmm. Much better. Some of my best work. Was it saying something? What was I doing? Ah, yes! Dealing with unwanted guests. And I will see you for the next 545 days in the next video. Bye bye!